So, Michelle, um, good to see you again. So, um, you know, it's really important to keep up your physical activity in pregnancy. Um, are you getting a lot of good regular exercise at the moment? No. Oh. <laughs> no, well, I'm yeah. it really hard this time. Yeah, um, it's tricky because you, you've got an older I've child. I've got a three-year-old yeah. as well. Yeah. Yeah. Just really tired with this pregnancy. Yeah, mm. absolutely. No, I totally know what you mean. I was same for me. So my first pregnancy, I was quite good. But then by the time I had a toddler as well, absolutely, you just knack it. And it's kind of like, oh, you can watch TV while I have a nap sort of thing. Yeah, and I totally understand. It's really hard. But, um... But it is really important, so um, it is something you really need to try and prioritise if you can. It's for your baby's health, so I know you want the best for your baby. Mm -hmm. um, so let's look at how we can just build that in for you. Um, now, so you're working a couple of days a week, is that right? Uh, yeah, I work full time. So oh, you work five full five days a week. Five yeah. days a week, okay. Mm -hmm. um, so how do you feel about maybe trying to do some exercise at lunchtime? Yep. Um, yeah, I have just a to walk around the block or busy schedule so we have uh, scheduled lectures and teaching over my lunch period so right. that's not so easy. Okay well, um, how about before work for you so sort of just perhaps um, start your day a bit earlier and you know get half an hour walking in before you start work could you do that? Um, I, I have also complications from my previous pregnancy so I've, I've got um, SPD Okay, it makes it really difficult and painful Oh, okay, walk. yeah, so maybe something not walking. Um, swimming mm. um, is much less impact and less stress. So if you've got a pool nearby, could you do, um, could you do some swimming a couple of times a week? Um, I guess so. Yeah, okay. Um, anything else you could fit in? Uh, it's quite difficult <laughs> dropping my son off at daycare in the morning, getting to work and then picking him up in the evenings just to find the time. Mm. And I'm exhausted at 8pm at night, so I yeah. can't head off to the pool. Yeah, the true. Of the day. Mm. So, Rochelle, how's the pregnancy going? Um, it's okay, yeah, I'm just quite tired and I have a bit of pain from um, my previous pregnancy uh, complications, so I've got SPD this time around, so it's okay. quite difficult to do as much exercise this time. Okay, is getting some exercise something that you would like to do if possible? Yeah, I did quite a bit during the first pregnancy, yep. um, but this time around I'm just too shattered. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I understand. What do you sort of already know about some of the benefits of, of, of getting some exercise if you can? Um, well, it's supposed to give you more energy in the long run, um, which is something that I'd really like because um, I just feel so tired all the time. Um, and also the health of my baby is yeah. sort of really important. Yeah, that's all mm. true. Good stuff. So um, what, if anything, do you think you might be able to do that's not going to cause pain? Anything that you enjoy that's not going to hurt? Um, well, I like swimming, yeah. um, and I did that last time, and it's okay. very low impact and quite good. Okay. Yeah. Um, would that be possible to fit in with your routine at the moment at all? Uh, not during the weekdays because I work full time um, and drop off some pickups with my son. Yeah. Um, but I could possibly do it on Sundays. Okay, if that the sounds pool's open. Okay, yeah. What would you need to do to put that into place? Do you think to mm, persuade my husband to look after my son? Yeah. <laughs> or we could make it a fun activity as yep. a family. Yeah. And how likely is that to to work for the family? Do you think? Is that seem like a realistic yeah um yeah I mean we could give it a go and yeah. see how it works first time and and whether we all like swimming yeah well that seems like a great yeah. first step yeah mm. when, when do you think you could start well this Sunday's free so yeah we could try then that sounds great yeah what might stop you do you think any barriers that you need to think about uh just the busyness of life I mean the weekends go by so quickly mm. we have heaps of other things on um yeah but I guess it's prioritising a time um, and yeah. not making it into a big deal. Mm. Maybe just a short swim is better than no swim. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Michelle, those two conversations were quite different, weren't they? Um, how did both feel for you? Oh, the first one was really awkward. Yeah. Um, and I just, uh, yeah, I just felt like I couldn't really um, 
fit your suggestions into my work day and working Even week. they were great suggestions. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, but the second one, maybe I can um, take on board a little bit easier. Okay. Did you notice what was different in terms of how I supported you or not in making a plan for change in either of those conversations? What do you think worked well? Um, well, the second time round, I sort of had to come up with the idea um, myself, something that might work with my family. Yeah. Um, first time round's a bit just, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just difficult. Yeah.